afternoon. My name is Charlamagne Fan Cottrell. I'm the director of the Bound program, and I just wanted to come to you all to kind of give you an update on what our new policies are, especially for those who missed the first Saturday or just for those who were here that may have forgotten. First thing that I want to come to you all about is let's change our way of thinking. Um, a lot of you are always looking for employment. And that's fine. That's a great thing. We encourage you to get a job and to work. But we want you to also consider Upper Bound a job. Um, it's going to require commitment. And it's going to require you to perform. It's going to require you to attend. Just like any other job. Any job that you take on is going to require you to be there to perform in order to get paid. And if you want to get promoted, then that means that you have to put in the extra work. Okay, so our main thing now is attendance. For attendance, that means all meetings are now mandatory. That includes tutoring. So if you're going to miss, you got to communicate. You got to tell us what's going on. Hopefully, you can get to all the tutorings. If for whatever reason you cannot, you need to let us know. We have Remind 101, we have Facebook. We have Instagram. There's no excuse for not getting a hold of us. So all meetings are mandatory from now on. In saying that, for your checks, you know, last semester we said if you come to eight meetings, then you get paid after that. Well, we've changed, made an amendment to the policy. So now it's four meetings for this spring semester, starting the spring semester. So you have to attend four meetings, which is two Saturdays and two tutorings in order to get your first check. Well, if you did not make the eight in the fall semester, you're still, you, you have to make the four in order to get all your checks from the fall semester. Okay, I, we can't, we can't harp on how much you have to be here. So make sure that if you want to get your stipend, if you want to get your mileage, that you show up. Okay. Well, as y'all know, we're preparing for summer, which is always a big deal for our students. And we are going to New Orleans. It has been approved. Yay, NOLA. And all, and all that good stuff. But there are some stipulations on you attending our summer program. In order to attend our summer program, it would be an invitation only. And when we say invitation only, we don't mean that we're just excluding everyone, no. If you make a 2.5 or better, if you come to the meetings, okay, let me go back. It doesn't necessarily have to be a 2.5 or better. We encourage you to do a 2.5 or better. But if we know you're putting forth the effort, that that's different. But you do have to attend. You do have to participate when you come. And that does not mean acting a fool. That does not mean... Like, some of the crazy things that you may do in high school. No, this means you have to come, participate in class, participate in workshops, participate in cultural events, those things. That's what I mean by participation. And you have to have good behavior. So, when I mean good behavior, this also includes high school. So, if at any moment we find out that you have been placed in in-school suspension or you have been suspended or whatever, then that is a mark against you. Okay, we do not encourage you to get sent to ISS. So please try, 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 try to be on your best behavior everywhere you go. You represent Upper Bound, you represent your family, you represent everyone that you know when you are out and about. So please, please try your best. To not get into ISS because we will be looking at that. We will be communicating with counselors. And if we see that you have any problems in your classes, we will be communicating with your teachers. And saying that, we need you to give us login information for your school portals. Now, we do know that some school portals are not working properly. That's fine. But... We need, to, we need to have that information so that every week we can go in, we can check, we can see where you are. Because you guys do not communicate very well. And we are here to help. That's our whole purpose, is to help you become successful students. So please, 
Give us those login information. If you are not sure whether or not you turned it in, just contact us and we will let you know. Okay, so just, just get that information to us. Also, um, what does that say? Bring homework to your tutoring sessions. That is helpful in getting ahead. Bring your homework. Cell phone policy still stands. So when you sign in, after right before you go to class, we'll take up cell phones. When we go before you leave, you can get your phones at 12, 12, 10, somewhere in there. And you can get your cell phones. We're now serving lunch. So, you know, you can get them when you come to lunch or whatever. But cell phones will be taken. If your parents need to contact you, they can always contact our offices. Okay. So, I'm pretty sure that's all that I have. Um, if anything else needs to be talked about, we will put another video up. We will make sure that it's shared and that you have access to it. Um, for those going the Sister Act, job well done. Congratulations on being invited to their Sister Act. Um, we will take you out to dinner beforehand, so no worries there. Um, we ask that you wear your polos. If you do not have one, then when you get here, we will provide you with one. If we don't have the right size, then you get, I mean, you just get out, you just get, get out of wearing a polo for a day. So, um, that's all. I'll talk to y'all later and hope to see you in here. Oh, no, that's not all. No. Make your weekly contacts. We are keeping track of that. We have always kept track of that. Make your weekly contacts. Every week that you don't make a weekly contact is 50 cents off your stipend. Yes, I said that. 50 cents off your stipend. That adds up when you get paid monthly. It makes a difference. So make your weekly contacts. We cannot harp on that enough. Weekly contacts. Okay. 50 cents deducted from your stipend when you don't make your weekly contacts. Okay. And for those and for those that miss the mandatory meeting, the the reprimand for not attending the mandatory meeting is means that the next cultural activity for the group you will not be able to attend because mandatory means that you have to be there. Not only did you forfeit your stipend, you forfeit the next cultural trip. Um, we we are harping on attendance. I know it. We're just we keep saying it, but we are harping on attendance. The more you attend, the better your grades get. Your grades, your your test scores increase. It's just very beneficial to be here. Okay, so attend, make weekly contact, bring homework to tutoring sessions and Saturday meetings. Um, and perform just, I mean, we don't mind you having fun, but we want you to, we want you to perform. Okay. So I hope y'all have a great weekend. Bye.